So we just had the end event over on Discord. Seven of us went in and killed the dragon, and I seem to have logged out deep within the end here. So I'm going to fly back. Fly back. Welcome back to Club Kafiri Khan. It's great to be back in Sanctuary, but we got so much work to do around here before the proper grand opening. I've already done quite a bit of building to fill out the base of the superstructure, but building isn't the only task we have today. Rather than wasting more time talking, let's get right to doing. So I haven't shown off much of the custom content of this season yet but here's one of the new features that I'm quite fond of. Weekly contests. Every week we can collect large amounts of random resources to compete with other players on the server. Of course, we get some fancy currencies for winning and placing high in the results too. These ones though. These ones are for my personal collection. The first thing I need to do is get a shop set up, so we're selling potions. Potions of weakness for cheap trades of villagers. Potions of mana for all the arcanists on the server, which is pretty much everyone. And a miscellaneous bin for whatever I'm experimenting with or come across on my journeys. Actually, uh, let's head up to my little brewery. So the main quest of this week is to find something I can create reliably that's not necessarily easy to get. These potions take five steps to create at level four, but I can automate this. Tedium means profit, baby. What if you can automate it and you won't get automated? They won't. But if they do, that's fine. I'm just using hoppers for now, but eventually I'll push a button and receive many potions. Anyways, we need a bunch of nether wart, arcane essence, glowstone dust, amethyst shards, and amethyst clusters. Like I had said, these quests for sanctuary, aside from building the dang thing of course, is to find unique stuff to sell. Profits, diamonds, getting the player economy running. Well, that's the goal at least. Sanctuary is going to play a large role in that. I already have a couple of players I want to open shops within the future upper layers of the tower, and there's already going to be three complete layers ready for the grand opening. New things have popped up on the Rubicon Project's bulletin board, so hopefully there will be enough around town to fill a whole episode with a Rubicon tour in the near future. I'm gonna go farm some guardians to see if I can stock Prismarine safely and reliably. And let's be honest, I just want a power conduit.
Saints live streaming, Saints in the end. Saint lost his stuff. We're gonna try to help him. Why did I swing this thing? We're gonna help him go get it. Shadow's here for moral support. Yay. <laughs> We're going in the old fashioned way. I almost forgot to put on my pumpkin. Are you going to compliment on how I said? No, I'm not going to compliment <laughs> on how you said. Okay, I'm going to hear you. <laughs> so, see, the problem is I don't know where he is in here. I closed his stream. So, this is just like good old fashioned searching for someone. Although. Oh. Hope I didn't scare you too bad. Yeah, please don't murder me by friend. No, 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 I'm not, I'm not trying to hurt. I'm trying to help. Is your stuff over there? Uh, working on that. I don't want to go any closer in fear of loading it and losing it. Yeah, that was kind of my concern. Yeah. Oh, do you know about where it is in there? I, I could dash in and yeah. nab it. Um, the bottom of the largest tower, I, w I would... Presume. Oh, there's like two really big towers in it. Bad news is I'm not seeing any clouds of items. Okay, okay, we're out, we're out, we're out, we're out. We did it. As far as I can tell, we got everything. Hello. Yeah, that was uh, an annoying room, to say the least. Yeah. I'm not actually seeing any electro weapons here. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, hold on. Did it auto go to my backpack? Or did it try to auto go? It did auto go to my backpack. Thank goodness. Okay. That would. That worried me because I did an extra pass on there to make sure. I was like, uh, that should be everything. There we go. Oh, crap, I didn't put those on yet. Right, well, I think I'm, uh, I think I'm going to start preparing more gear instead of stay here because this is pretty dangerous oh well i only wanted to pop one but yes i don't blame you safe travels same to you Chris Marine, we're gonna need a proper farm if we wanna sell it. But we do have potions and magics. It has left me little time this episode to build, but I've got done what I can. We've got some lower caps for the walls of the tower, creating arch-like entranceways into the arrival era sanctuary. You can hopefully tell what mod influenced the design of these end caps, and I love how they've turned out. I'm still working on the wall designs themselves, but we'll definitely see a lot more build progress next episode. I have had an idea for a lore series in addition to this main series, but it's in very early development. We're talking outlines at this point, and I'm very excited to show you what's down there. But it'll have to wait until next time. Come join the Clubcraft Discord. There's a link in the description. And if you're enjoying the series so far, consider subscribing so you don't miss the next one. Oh, I still need to finish the docks lair. Uh, hey, what should I put for the flooring down there? Leave me a comment with your suggestion. It's been fun, as it always is. And we'll be back soon to plan our grandest of openings.
See you then.